بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد حبت في الله in a beautiful athar of the salaf رحمهم الله جميعا comes the athar of fudail ibn iyad rahimahullah ta'ala in which he said حرام على قلوبكم أن تسيب الحلاوة الإيمان حتى تزهدوا في الدنيا السير فضيل بن عياض رحمه الله تعالى he said it is not permitted for your hearts to experience the sweetness of faith until you give up some of the dunya tazhadu fi dunya you give up you have that asceticism that you remove the dunya from your heart that you don't crave to follow and chase your desires so this is imperative for us ahabbat fi llah that we take heed of those athar of the salaf as-salih that we benefit from what they offered us this is the these are the precious pearls and gems that the Salaf left behind us, behind for us, so that we can learn the proper methodology, the proper minhaj, the proper tar- tarbiyah, the proper uh, way of being brought up in the religion, so that we were open to accept the deen. Because the Salaf al-Saleh, Ridwan Allahi alayhim, they had the tarbiyah. They prepared their hearts for iman. They didn't just dress the part, grow the beard, shorten the thobe, wear the, the, the big beautiful hijab, wear the uh, niqab, and so on and so forth, without that tarbiyah, without that halawat al-iman. They worked on their iman first. They worked on building themselves to where they acted the part. They played the part. They lived and experienced the part in the deen. And unfortunately, we're, we're bil'aq, we're the opposite. And we ask Allah the Almighty to bless us with a khlas, with a bad, to help us to leave off excessive love in the dunya, which distorts our iman, which distorts our perception of reality, which distorts our striving. It deviates us from the path of the righteous. The path of the Salaf al-Saleh, the path of Jannah, the Sabil al-Mu'mineen, wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad.